Spy Master 3000. The Scout Master of Black Nebula, Nebula has escaped, escaped and rejoined the Legion of Peril. With your Bonsai Master and skills of an Ace Pruner, intercept the enemy and... Hey! Look what you did! I'm sorry, it was an accident. I don't care, you still broke it. You're gonna pay for this. You're gonna have to buy a new one, Michelle. Oh my, Jason, goodness gracious. I was minding my own business when Michelle ripped the cord right out of the machine. It was an accident, and I said I was sorry. Can't Jason just forgive me? No, I can't. I don't care if you're sorry. It's still broken, and you owe me a new one. Oh, you poor lad. And you were minding your own business, too. Hmm. It seems I remember a time when I was minding me own business, and a certain party put a baseball right through me kitchen window. <laughs> or how about the time you karate chopped me living room lamp? Or the time you smashed Aunt Emma's pie plate, or... Those were accidents. Listen, before you go handing out blame, you, of all people, should be more forgiving. Blessed are those who show mercy, for they shall be shown mercy. Be thou merciful just as God is merciful. Any of that ring a bell? Yes, the good book says so. You still owe me a new controller! About time you showed up. This is the big one. Hop in. Let's sing a little song with eight little words about a rocket ship and flightless birds. <laughs> Kevin. Taste the excitement? Yeah! About what? We're undertaking a new mission. A secret mission. A huge big deal mission. Captain, uh, the Admiral said it was a routine mission. Like our mission to the dump. But the Admiral gave us something to deliver. What does that tell you? Another trip to the dump? Hey, Captain, you lose something? All right, where is it? Where's what? My spheroid crystals. You mean your marbles? They're called spheroid crystals. What's going on? <sighs> I lost my marbles. Kevin, give them back. Sparkly. Marbles? Genuine Zirko Cusonians. Are they valuable? He won them at the Saturn Carnival. Came in second in the ring toss. First place was a glow-in-the-dark teddy bear. Hey, I won them just the same. Can I see them? Sorry, Jason. Far too valuable. On a sentimental scale. We're expecting further orders from the big guy any minute. <sighs> this could be the one that puts me over the top. Know what I mean? Captain Sigil! Admiral! Big guy! Uh, big strap! Uh, Captain Sigil reporting for duty, sir. Good day, Captain. I'm sorry for all the secrecy. You were told this was a routine mission. But in reality, it's not. This is the big one. I knew it! How big? Real big. You and your crew will proceed to Mercy Falls to deliver a rather important package to their king. It is the crown jewel, the largest and rarest emerald in the universe, worth a galaxy's weight in gold. Be very, very careful with it. You 
can count on me, sir. On to Mercy Falls! Perfect. For a moment there, I thought you were going to hit the water. All right, I've got the emerald. I'm only allowed to take one person into the palace to meet the king. How do we decide who goes? By the official Federation ceremony. One, two, three, shoot! Rock, break, scissors! I win! Oh, I must remember to throw something besides scissors. Next time, I'll throw beans. Okay, Jason, stay close and let me do all the talking. Hey, come on in. Glad you can make it. Welcome to my humble abode. Your reptile highness, I... So what you bring me? Is that my rock? Uh, yes, sir. And let me say that as captain of the USPF Rockhopper and decorated member of the United Federation, it is my esteemed pleasure and great honor to present to you... <laughs> I broke my emerald. I, I, I... You know how much that cost? Well, I, I, I... I didn't think so. But you sure are gonna pay for what you've done. Guards, get him! Huh? Hey, look! It's Elvis! Where? Where'd he go? Over there! Look under the throne! Rockhopper, come in! Somebody, anybody, pick up! Oh, hello, Captain! How's the ceremony going? It must be over by now. Oh, yeah, it's all over. How did he like it? Who was he surprised? Yeah, big time. Listen, I broke the emerald, smashed to pieces. You what? Uh, how? I don't know. You gotta help me. Go get help. Go get Admiral Strap. Do you read? Loud and clear, Rocket Boy. Loud and clear. All right, let's review, shall we? I get the greatest opportunity of my life. I present the king with the emerald, smash it to pieces, and wind up in jail. Don't worry, we'll get you out. Not very likely, small fry. Look, your majesty, Ness, this is all a big mistake. I'm really sorry. I don't care if you're sorry. But it was an accident. Well, somebody's gotta pay for my emerald. Fair is fair. So, how long are you gonna hold me, your royal reptile? Until you repay me. I'm putting you to work. Work? Yes, sirree. You can shine shoes for a nickel down on the corner till that emerald is paid for. <gasps> that will take years! You know you could go easy on him. I suppose you'll tell me how. Well, it was an accident after all, your majesty. He said he's sorry. Please, could you show him a little mercy? Mercy? As in, blessed are those who show mercy, because they shall be shown mercy? Do I know my Bible or what? Yeah, my grandmom said that to me just this morning. Is that a fact? Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please forgive me your gaiterness. I'm really, really, really sorry. <laughs> I'll never do it again. I'll give you anything else you want. My bobblehead collection. My favorite blow dryer. Just please let me go. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm begging you. Dr. Vigil to Admiral Strap. Come in. I'm sorry. The person you are trying to reach... Admiral Strap! ...is unavailable. If you would like more information, press 1 now. If this is an urgent matter, press 2 now. If you would like to hear music while you wait, press 3 now. 
Uh, Fidgel, we got problems. Now! Ah! Good day! I hope I'm not intruding. <laughs> so what did you do to your grandma that she had to remind you to show mercy? I didn't do anything to my grandma. It was my sister. She ripped out a cord from my video game by mistake. By mistake? Yes, just like I broke your emerald. By mistake. It could happen to anyone. Right. So did you forgive your sister, Jason? Uh, well, not exactly. Maybe I should have. Well, okay. I'll let your friend off for now, because I trust you will forgive your sister. Right? Say yes. Come on, Jason. I can't take being in stir. Lock up the Grey Bar Hotel. Uh, Red Bar Hotel. I gotta get out of here! Okay, I'll forgive her. Maybe I did overreact a little. Really? Ow! <laughs> that always cracks me up. <laughs> thank you, Your Majesty. Yes, thank you, Your Lizardness. Well, looks like all our trouble is over. This is Baron Von Cavitus. Escape is impossible. Cavitus, what do you want? Oh, you penguins are so playful. All right, let's see if you can guess. It's something big and shiny and very valuable. Marbles! For the emerald. Correct. Bob, tell him what he's won. Two marshmallow dust unless he hands over the emerald. You'll be covered in sugary goo. Now hand over the jewel. How did you know about the emerald? Every pirate ship from here to the gas nebula knows about the crown jewel. We've been watching you, and now it's time to collect. Uh, but, uh, we don't have it. As a matter of fact, the emerald is... Shh! If he finds out the emerald is destroyed, he'll blast us for sure. The emerald is what? What happened to it? Uh, um, uh, Zidril took it to Planet Mercy Falls. Give us a little time and perhaps we can locate it for you. Hmm. How much time? Oh, an hour or two? You have five seconds. Five. Hey, wait a minute. You're making a mistake. Four. Is he serious? One. Oh, I hate when that happens. Did you hear something? We should tidy up a little. Oh, fix, Bart! Get rid of these marbles, pronto! Mayday, Mayday, we're under attack! Chavitus is after the emerald! Mayday, can anyone read us? That's not exactly what I meant. Uh oh. Mitchell, is that you? Captain, are you all right? Yeah, we're fine. That king's a nice fellow. He actually forgave me for that little accident I had. I guess you called the Admiral for nothing. We never got to the Admiral. We hit some trouble. Trouble? It wasn't that burrito you had for lunch, was it? I told you to check the expiration date. No, Captain, it was Cavitus. He's off to the Emerald. <laughs> well, he'll never find it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, you should get back here. Lickety split. We're on our way. Then out of the blue, we were surrounded by cavities. And then Kevin spilled your bag of marbles and must have hit the vertical stabilizer. We dropped like a stone with marbles flying everywhere. Well, I tell you, if the fixed bot hadn't jettisoned those marbles, we'd still be. Wait a minute. What was that? 
What happened to my marbles? You what? Gone? Gone? Do you have any idea how valuable those marbles were? What they meant to me? We're terribly sorry, Captain, but they were only marbles. My lucky marbles. The agony. The shame. First jail, and now this? How much is a penguin supposed to take? <laughs> so you forgive us for losing your marbles? Are you nuts? You're gonna pay for those marbles if it's the last thing you do! Now that's an interesting idea coming from you. Be sure Cavitus will be coming any moment to get that emerald. He'll hunt down Zizzle because he thinks he has it. And when he doesn't find it, who knows what he'll do? You're right. We need to get Zizzle before Cavitus does. Woke up this morning, gonna polish some shoes. You know I got trouble. I got them broken emerald blue. Mercy. Well, that's a nickel. One down and 47 bajillion to go. I sure hated to do that, but that old boy just took advantage of the mercy I just showed him. Asking me for forgiveness for his mistake, but showing his friends no mercy for theirs. But he sure did a nice job on my blue suede shoes. Hmm. I'm bored. Me too. What do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? I don't know. What was that? Commander Strap, is that you? Come to save me? Not likely, Penguin. It is I, Cavitas. I'm going to break you out. That's very thoughtful of you. I am not thoughtful. I want that emerald. Do you think we ought to tell him the emerald's broken? He's going to be awfully disappointed when he finds out. Shh. Don't say a word. No telling what he might do. Okay, good idea. You sure come in handy. <laughs> Get it, handy? Cavitus threw me a grappling hook. Is that bad? It's bad if you don't lead me to that emerald! Quick, take these! Cavitus! All right, hold it right there. And what do you think you're doing? I know this looks bad, mate, but if you let us explain... Ah! Whoa! Ah! So... You're here to bust out your friend with your warship. Well, actually, that's not our warship. That's Cavitus. He's here for your emerald. What? <laughs> oh. Mel blasts! Run for your lives! Oh, oh. Me next. Me next. Surrender the emerald. I want that emerald! Attention, Warship. This is the USS Federation. We have you surrounded. Give yourself up. Admiral Strap's mothership. This isn't over, Penguins. I shall return. Dr. Vigil, sorry for the delay. I just got my voicemail. <gasps> no problem, Admiral. You're right on time. Your Royal Highness, this is Admiral Strap. My sincere apologies for all the confusion. I trust your emerald got there safe and sound? Well, about that. Your man here is in a heap of trouble. Admiral, your majesty, 
I think we can work this out. This is all turned into a big mess, and somebody still has to learn a lesson. Told ya. I was talking about you, Captain. And me, too. Oh. You see, like Michelle, you had an accident that affected someone else. But unlike me, the king was kind enough to show you mercy. He didn't have to. That was awfully kind of him. But then your friends made a little mistake. And what did you do? I'd rather not talk about it. You refused to show your friends any mercy after begging me for forgiveness. It was such bad behavior, I couldn't let you off again. You did exactly opposite of what you asked me to do. Blessed are those who show mercy, for they shall be shown mercy. What does that mean? It means we all make mistakes, and sooner or later, we're going to need somebody to show us mercy. So, we should be merciful to others. I understand that now. Guys, I'm really sorry. I hope you can forgive me. I forgive you. After all, we all make mistakes, and we need to be forgiven with each other when that happens. Learned your lesson? You're free to go. Thank you. Thank you very much. Michelle, I'm sorry I got so angry about the controller. I knew it was an accident, and... How are you doing that? You don't need a new controller. It's not broken after all. It's not? Nope. It just came unplugged. No big deal. Oh, now that's what I like to see. You two getting along like two cheery turtle doves cozy in a nest. I learned my lesson. Show forgiveness because we all make mistakes. Oh, very good, Jason. I'm proud of you. All righty then, I'm off to me garden to trim me flora bundas and polyanthus. Wait for me! What about Bonsai Master? Gardening is more fun. Nice try, Captain. Your new Bonsai High score is 1,032,500. Please enter your name. Captain Michelle. Hey, can I help? 